get about 25 wood. That way we don't have to worry about the next five camps. We gotta push this corruption back. This area is all corrupted. them oh stood in front of that uh oh we're corrupted right took the corruption off ah we ran into more hold on now hold on now um not abandoning i'm still part of this we're we got this under control Everything is under control. It's all under control. Yikes! I'm dead. I'm so dead. Ah, uh, no, run away. Uh, I don't think I'm hit over there. <laughs> run away. Can I rest? Do you mind if I rest here? No, I can't rest? Okay. Uh, ah. How far? How far are you gonna chase me? Yeah, get pissed off, but go back. Look at all these guys. Thought I just went in with the hammer in the first place and just started picking them off. You, I could still kill. <sighs> yep, that's right. Run away. All right, let's think about that. What just happened? <laughs> what could we do differently? How can we prevent that from happening again, guys? All right, get gooder, got it. All right, let's head east and try to actually do something. And I'll even mark it like I say. This marker here, the little Google marker up there, that's how I find out where I'm going. Cause I can get turned around mining and grabbing stuff. A lot of the times whenever I'm, I'm really like distracted and I can't figure out like which direction I'm heading, what I'm supposed to be doing, I'll throw those markers down so I don't forget. It's like, oh yeah, over here's this quest that I was going to grab and I was doing a circuit. I was going to go around to this one next and then work my way over to the west. Ooh, cool. We were on something there. Still trying to be mindful that we're mining. So, I do need to mine more often. What kind of roll was that? He rolled like the Matrix. Alright. I'm literally gonna hit anything that I can mine until I get to 100. So, if I see rocks and then the rocks keep showing up, that's just what I'm gonna do. We still got that marker, so I'm not going to forget that's what I'm doing. I'm, I'm heading towards that marker this whole while I'm doing this. This is how I've been doing it. It's like, try to get an objective. They're all mostly the same, and they all really don't do a whole lot, but you still need to choose one, so just choose any one. Head that direction. And then do the things that interest you along the way. I didn't need that tree, but I went ahead and kept chopping it because it was already dead anyways. Here's that silk weed. Yeah, buddy. Let's see what we get this time. Pay attention. Silk threads. Okay, so this is where the silk comes from. This must be how you get the sateen as well, or satin. I saw like a crafting thing that needed that as a resource. I see the star metal over there. I'm not going that way because I don't have a hundred yet. Oh, scared me little ghost. Why are you going to sneak up on me like that? I knew he was creeping too. I knew it. I could hear him the whole while. And then the creepy music stopped too. 
Hey there, are you headed across the river into Greyvale? I don't know why he sounds like this. That's bear territory. I know that firsthand because for me, it was also my home. No, they don't want me. They've made it painfully clear. My wife Susan and I lived among them for decades in perfect harmony until a few years ago. One day, they turned on us, tore us both apart, and feasted on our flesh. Susan became the loss after that. Don't why I'm still here except for revenge. In fact, a few of the beasts. In fact, destroy a few of the beasts for me, and I'll reward you. Damn, son, Holt Hutchinson, man. Gotta help Mancrick find his wife. It's got very Mancrick vibes on him. It's like, ah, uh, Holt. Your story about your wife's kind of foreboding. Seventy-four mining. Here comes seventy-five. No ghosts gonna sneak up on me. Seventy-five. Still heading towards that little marker, which is behind me now. Oh, cause I did it already. Okay, let's go to this one. So we're gonna head east towards that. And I got a mark. You can hear the screams. Someone's getting chewed on. Oh, look, there's a bear there. He's getting eaten. Oh, maybe I could shoot it. You can hear him screaming for dear life. I got you, man. Oh, no. He despawned. No. I didn't even have any bullets. He sees me, doesn't he? Ah, I ate him. How dare you, bear? How dare you? Ow, why are you so strong? Ow, you are really strong. Ow, you are really, really strong, buddy. I think uh, I know what happened to that other guy. Uh. <laughs> I tried to go for some light swings thinking that this will be a quicker swing and he won't even hit me before and he swung quicker than my quicker swing so that's that I can't help but respect that I mean I don't like that bear but damn do I respect him okay I need to head back out there and try to get some revenge Let's get let's get that heavy armor. Let's see what that heavy armor can do against this stuff. Cause this is the point. Like this is why I ran out there and I wanted to see to begin with. It was like I felt like I could kill him, but I need to be able to take a hit. I can't I can't have a glass jaw, guys. Can't walk out there with the glass jaw. So we're gonna we're gonna swip over. We're gonna swap over. We're gonna swip swap. We're gonna as soon as I can figure out there we go. That one? This one. This one, that one, and this one. And you can see we're kind of heavy now. A little outfit change too. Lo looking like a certain way. Okay. And then that's going in here because we ain't got no bullets, so there's no point in having a gun. The hatch is just for running. We can go shield and sword. Really show them both the the bear what's up. That could be interesting. I'm gonna drop the spear and go sword and shield. And we're gonna see what a full strength tank looks like. Oh, this is inspiring to me. What is this? Physicals. It says our physical damage. A uh, score, I guess you would call it, is 796. We have 832 in elemental. With, with the gear, we're getting 42 uh, constitution. And then I'm spec the rest. Excuse me. Uh, I'm spec the rest into strength. Alright, let's see how that performs then. There's a festering hive here. Oh, that's a level 35. Of course I'm gonna get my ass ran over there. Let's go this way. I'm not gonna mess with that. I'm, I'm definitely gonna plant another camp over this way though. 
Let's go hatch it so we can boogie. Hatch it time. Boogie. Raka kaka 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 kaka. Yikes. Let's see what it is. Yeah, you missed. Bam! <laughs> that is a cool ability. What is this? Is that the same ghost? That's the ghost from the dog. It was a werewolf. All right, let's throw a camp right here. Fishing's kind of cool in this game too, guys. There's bear here, so there's probably salmon. I'll save you, Rexus. <laughs> I fell in the water. <laughs> I can't even save Rexus. Rexus? I can't even get him. <laughs> I can't even get him. <laughs> It's so stupid. <laughs> Here, let me just let me try to res. <laughs> He's gonna get hit. <laughs> Ow! I suck. <laughs> He's so bad at video game. Oh, a oh, hundred damage is not good. Let me try blocking on. Let me try blocking on for a sight. Ah, I don't have stamina. This dude can res and run back before I'm gonna beat this thing. Hold on, let me get some health. Let me get some health, bear. Getting some hit points back. Uh, let's try putting a tree in between us. Ah! Man, you cannot dodge when you're wearing armor. Shite, man. <laughs> okay. <laughs> ah! Oh no! Hopefully he's returning. Praxis, I got you. There you go. <laughs> How is <was> humiliating? <laughs> <laughs> Don't die, Raxus. Kill him, man. Kill him. Is that his green stuff? Oh, he's a spear man. Is he okay? <laughs> He's pretty strong. He said, like, yeah, bears suck. Yeah, the flatten and knock down stuff. <laughs> okay. My sword and shield is not set up very well either. I don't know if I like the way it's... I do like the, the bitch slap. That's pretty fun. Maybe I'll do that more. Uh... Uh, swing and a miss. <laughs> I can't even get their attention. Ow. <laughs> I'm not a tank. <laughs> what am I? <laughs> he literally said thunk. <laughs> I got knocked out like thunk. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> this is crazy. Let me set this up properly because I can't be getting bitch slapped for free like that. Abilities are on cooldown. What can we do here? Block gain in power. Successful heavy in power. 
Heavy attack loses a debuff. Sword crit increase. Mobility. Final attack slow. Heavy attack and power. I like this, and it's a taunt. If you have a Carnelia Jail, this ability would cost taunt. Oh, if I have a gem on the sword. Um, physical armor. Yes. And then reducing magic damage, block gain fortify, stamina reduced when block is ranged attack, stamina reduced by 15% when blocking a melee with a shield, uh, concussive bash, 15% of your max health. I kind of like this tree a little more, I think. Weapon damage, weapon damage. Leaping damage. Ooh, leaping. Final attack causes slow. Heavy. Or empower. Heavy attack empower. Move faster while blocking. Block gain, gain in power. I'm going this way. And then... Deal 10% damage to damage. Flow. Gain in power for blocking or move faster while blocking. Probably move faster. Hit a foe below 30%, deal 50% more damage. Leaping strike hits targets in the back, it causes slow. Uh, neither of those are really necessary, actually. Rush forward, knocking enemies back. Hit all enemies. I like this rush forward thing. I think I'm done in this tree and I'm going to go in this tree now. I like 15% more armor as well, though. That'll be the next one, I guess. And that'll get us up to improved rush, hopefully. Or do I actually need to put something in that tier? We'll see. At least now we're a little bit more set up. I wouldn't say properly. I was going to say properly. We're not set up properly, but we're, we're set up a little bit more. More consciously, we'll say. There's a little bit more conscious thought behind the setup. When I was initially... I was just slapping points into the weapon when I initially did it. I think that's why the respec was free, because I'd never respec before. Alright, here we are. Oh, wrong uh, shit. Let's go this way. Ah, uh, it's on cooldown. Get off of cooldown. Give me my hammer. I need that strength. Give me a shield. Yeah, I'm moving faster when I go backwards. This is sexy. I'm like literally dodging everything. I don't have to hit it. Or I don't have to get hit. He's gonna do some bullshit. Oh man, I got greedy. I think our friend might help us here though. Much better though. You can see it's much better now that I know what I'm doing. <laughs> Please. <laughs> Thanks. Here. Ho ho ho! Yeah, I gotta get used to that. Once you throw that shield on, that's pretty much what you're signing up for. Signing up for the pain game. The pain train game. Mame. Mame. Uh. Constitution. We have not much. Eight. Const 13. Five. We could get a lot more constitution as well. Let's fish for a bit, maybe. Tried casting once or twice. This is fresh water. 
So let's see if we got any bait. We got some wood louse. That was from our, our gathering adventures earlier. We got some relaxing nightmare sounds to some fishing. We got a large perch there. It's a two pound perch. It's pretty large for a perch. A small trout, about two pounds. I'm trying to max it, but I keep on missing it. I, I hold it. I held it too long just now. As soon as it starts bobbing, it's like, get ready. That's the hook about to get set. And as soon as you see the fish, you can set the hook. I don't know if it increases your chances of getting like a higher quality loot or anything to do that faster, but I generally try to keep it green whenever I'm setting the hook. I try to like set it as quick as possible. Because if there's a skill check on the distance like this, damn, I missed it again. Then there's probably a skill check aspect to this as well. But I, it's just me guessing. I have no idea actually. See, that still went yellow there. And this is just the tension. Like, you can kind of see the fabric getting stretched from the tension. And that's just how, how bad the fish is fighting back as you reel it in. You can snap your line if you let it get too high. Ah, there's a max cast. And that's just the furthest distance for me. That's 14.9 meters right there. So about 15 meters is the max. And I imagine that allows there to be maybe more rare fish because you're not, you know, as close making all your human breathing sounds, scaring them away. Yeah, this one's putting up a fight. Not a lot, just like a little bit more than normal. On a good one, sometimes I could get like two really long reels in. But when the when they fight like that, sometimes it takes like five or six reel. Oh, I just broke that. Look, I'm gonna try to do it in is the least amount of reels as possible to show you what I mean. And go. Alright. One long reel. Let it go back. And another long reel. Ooh, it's too close. That one was like two and a half. And that's a salmon. I have a mission from one of the boards. It says to catch a large salmon, I think it was. I have yet to catch that many salmon back to back to back, but I haven't really went to any specific areas or like looked into researching where salmon come from or what type of bait to use or what time of day or any of that stuff. Just randomly, just like fishing in stagnant water like this. And this water ain't stagnant. This this fresh water. Just in random water that I find in the world when I fish, I don't get the stuff from that board. Like, I don't get 15 salmon or 5 salmon or whatever's required. This one's some work to reel in. What is this? A medium sturgeon. Looks like a, a shark almost. The dude over there fighting that bear. 
The bear still at full health. Jay truly. Maybe we go see what's up. I need to get this bear too, so. Put it in his ass. I don't think he liked it. I still need two more bears. Maybe I'll actually do that. Since there's somebody else around the area. I think what I make, make, uh, what I lack in threat generation as far as the gymming and all that shit goes. I'd hopefully make up for in the strength that I got on my gear and how hard that I can hit them. <clears throat> I think if we can catch this guy unaware, it's more damage. That was cheesy. They did shenanigans so he could get his hit off. He don't like that he can't hit me right now. I keep on forgetting I can't dodge. I gotta sit here and block. We're gonna get this 15 second heal here. Just kite this guy around the trees. Damn, I can't roll. Fuck. I'm gonna get killed. <laughs> I think I'm all like spry like I was when I was wearing light gear. But I'm heavy. Like I am when I'm wearing heavy gear. Oh god. Don't do it to me, man. He's gonna bleed me. Don't bleed me, bro. Just take your time. Be patient. Someone will walk by and they'll be like, hey. This guy looks like he's in trouble. I guess I'll throw a little bubble with this guy. And kill him for him. Alright, let's go. Yep, yep, that's fancy. Very good. It's an all out melee! Man, that was 86 points in sword mastery. Okay. One more of those. Yeah, I think the heavy armor was necessary. That was a lot of skinning points too. Holy shit. All right, one more bear. Let's go further in. And keep our eyes peeled for rocks and ore. Yeah, I just eat through that food though. I can't be using that buff food like that. That's kind of why I have it though. I should put the little food out. If I'm gonna be eating it like that. I need to just make a day of just like respect to dexterity and just run out and skin all day. But again, like we're gonna end up in that same situation where I got like all my inventory full of mats. Yeah, it's it's tricky because uh, you can get a house. You, you can get a house and increase your inventory space and all that and carry and store more stuff in the towns. Uh, but you're sacrificing like, you know, trading costs and crafting fees and all that stuff if you do that. That's what I did though. I went ahead, like I expanded the storage on a lot of places, increased the standing and reputation gain, as well as the experience. Uh, in the level one to 25 zones, for most of those, if I was given the option to increase XP, I did that. Cause they're just the level one to 25 zones, so I can level up fast through those zones. And then the higher level zones, I imagine, that might be where I wanna spend most of my points in crafting fees and all that shit 
Unless something better comes along, I don't know. Or unless I change my, my focus in some way. I'm trying to become an armor or weapon crafter and miner. I'm trying to get away from skinning and uh, gathering. And be more just like strength mining and uh, armor craft weapon crafting type shit. I guess I'd be like jewel cutting as well. But yeah, I think I'm going to have to really choose what I want to store and sell everything else. The problem is you can't sell more than 100 items on the market at a time. And I don't know if that's like 100 items per market per city. Like each city has its own separate 100 items list. Or if it's like a shared list across all the cities. Because I think it is the case that each market has its own inventory. So if I go to the, the trade market here in this settlement, I'm only going to see what this settlement's selling. I'm not going to see stuff from Everfall unless I go to Everfall. I think that's how it works. Maybe I need to find that out when it matters. When I care about it, I'll look it up and I'll find out for sure. Alright, so... We need one more bear. I was hoping coming up here would show me some of these, but this has already been tapped. All right, looks like someone's already two steps ahead of me. That's okay though, because I can still hit the rocks. Level up. And as a, a strength build, I get reduced carrying weight of mined items, so minus 10% to their weight. We're looking for bears. Bears and ore. I thought poking up here I'd probably see more precious ore. Which there is, but somebody's hitting it, so I gotta gotta keep moving. Someone hit that star metal one too. These guys are out there, guys. They're hitting everything. Where are the lumberjacks at? Lumberjacks are all con constitution, so if I wanted to be like a tank main spec, I'd probably go lumberjack. Cause they got like increased speed and logging this is logging speed increase wow just by gear i got enough for health consumables to last longer and logging speed and i was still able to keep these wow cool yeah this is the stand here and take a few hits kind of setup Are there really no bears? I guess I need to head more south. Give me that. I'm gonna poke over to this mountain too. I really want to level mining. I, I'm close to 100 already. If I see a bear, I'll cut across and grab him. <clears throat> I don't know if just hitting regular boulders has a chance to give you gems, but that would be kind of nice. I know I could cut them or polish them or something. I don't know if I get gems that way. I don't, I don't know. I can't see nothing. Let me poke by this little jutting out piece here. Piece of mountainside over here. This don't 
This probably don't just sit here like this for no reason. If I were to assume. If I were to venture a guess, there's probably some kind of a mineral up here. Hear me out, guys. Hear me out. Stick with me here. Still looking at the sides, expecting to see stuff along the way. Oh, is it gonna let me? Um. Hmm. Get up there. Come on, man. I know you weigh a lot. You can get up there, though. Get it. Get it. There you go. Up here. I think I've tried this before. I feel like I've been here. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe not. Maybe not. If there was a way, it would probably be easier than this. All right. We'll call that a wrap. That's not it. That ain't the one. Sometimes you can get on top of those. And I've been on the top of one of those little mountainy ones like that. And there's just like a perfect little node sitting there. Waiting for somebody to come at him.